Hey everyone, what's up? This is Blaze along with Blue. Hello! We're in episode 92 in the outer yard. We have to go collect a book. <laughs> Look, I, I can already see the fire on like the rooftops. Oh, uh, let me see this. Uh, oh, yeah, see? yep. That one's already getting like destroyed. So. Oh my god. That was the tower we went in last time. That was. That was a. That was with the. Um, was that the one who was enchanted? Who was like stuck behind there? Uh, that was what? the owl. Excuse no, that me. Was, yeah. That was in the other. What is this room? Oh my gosh, it's all coming back to me. The Book of Armaments is a heavy tome detailing oh. a history Wait, what? of weapons and I didn't get, huh? I didn't get, I didn't get the thing. You know what? It tends to happen like that, Nate. Oh my dialogue's off too. Sister Constance. Hello, it's I. Uh, who was that? Was that Sister Constance? That was Sister Constance. I, I, thought, I thought I heard her off in the distance. Sl yeah, slight possession. Um, I've been watching too many spooky movies lately. I watch one like every night almost. I'm at Sister, by the way. My port's on? Hold up. I'm almost yeah. there anyway. Oh, okay. All right. Chill, 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 chill. I like dialogue was off because I turned it off so I didn't have to listen nine earlier. To 21. Mm -hmm. And Sister Attila raised the pomegranate up on high, saying, O oh, sacred spiral, bless this pomegranate, that with it thou mayest blow thy enemies to tiny bits what? in thy mercy. Sister Attila? No, oh, it's not a common name for a girl. Oh, why do you ask? We need to get a sacred pomegranate from the royal garden, but the gates are locked fast. There is another still loyal to Gwendolyn and King Arturius. That's Find Mark. Squire Billy. He'll know how to get into the royal You know, garden. I'm really curious, though, about how powerful these pomegranates really are, Nate. Well, if there's one thing that you want to make into a bomb, I guess a pomegranate is a good choice. Well, I mean, that's At the least thing. for her. I mean, I'm just, I don't know. I'm really confused how fruit can be a Life weapon. Life isn't easy from the queen's side. I feel like I'm down in the hole, but some emotions are hard to hide. I'm down in the dumps. Can I help you? The key to the royal garden is held by the great horned knight, one of the Pendragon's champions. He's in the Sworn Tower. There are a lot of towers in this world. They like towers. You know, it comes down to the point where it's just like, I'll when are we done with the well. outer yard? What is this again? Mysterious well. What's down here? I don't know. <laughs> I don't, I'm kind of scared. I don't really want to go down there. <laughs> I just don't go in random holes, Nate. Well, it's kind of weird that it has like the sigil, but we never have to go down. Well, I don't know. Maybe we have to go down that later. Mm. I don't really remember. I really don't want to. <laughs> I refuse to go down there. I do, actually. It gives me great pleasure to welcome you to the Sworn Tower, Knight of the Weird. By the Horned Crown, I swear I will honor you by mounting your head upon the wall there. You got them prisms? Yes. We're going in. Three. Moros Blunt. To be blunt. Well, That's yeah. Me. How much? Fourteen. Ooh. They don't make it easy. 13.7. We need to blade for a lot here, so. I'm gonna triple blade before I hit because. Yeah. That's no a reason good not idea. to because if I don't crit, it does. It'll probably do 9 to 10,000 if I don't with, without a crit. So the rest of that. Yeah. It's up in the air. Because he'll resist it. Mm. Fire dragon. Oh, right. Yeah, no. Because yeah. over time, yeah. Alright, let's see. And I had see. to prism too, I forgot about that. <laughs> yeah, you do. Don't worry. I, I can get some more blades on you in that time. I mean, this could be the guy that's like burning everything, because, you know. Fire. Oh, this is on me. Alright, so you put in those hits. <laughs> I'm trying to think of any legitimate way of me removing this, and I can't think of it. The fact that I don't have a cleanse in, <laughs> and the moment I didn't restock one, because <laughs> I thought we were above that Avalon. I have to meteor. There's nothing else I can That's do. That's fine. You can meteor. <laughs> That's perfectly acceptable. And he, he frees you again. Hey, you know what, Nate? 
This stuff happens in a real walk. This isn't a real walk. Unless I get e free. Oh, thank you. Okay, a little boost. Yeah. I don't know what- I should carry a cleanse. I always used to. What am I doing? Oh my gosh. See, I took it for granted that we weren't actually going to get e-freeded anytime soon. I mean, I know I'm going to carry one throughout all of Azteca and Chrysalis. Well, time to rejuice. Basically start over. <laughs> uh-huh. That's perfectly acceptable. At least I had plenty of these things, huh? So I kind of came prepared. I think I only have one meteor now. So... Yeah, it happens. And I don't put in wants because, you know, ever since the update with removing stuff, like, like why wouldn't I remove it? Yeah. Um, TC Faint. The sad fact is I had to use my 40 item. Card. That's the biggest tragedy of the episode. That's the biggest tragedy of all that. Like, I, I pro that's actually the worst thing to happen in this world. That you could not use that 40 blade. We've done a lot of battles, too. It's very rare to, uh, not have a plan. E3, number two? Oh my gosh, every time it, like, zooms in so quick, I have a heart attack. Like, yep, that's my fate. I mean... They're dealing some damage. They're yeah, they're not bad. I'm below two thousand. I got heals, but <laughs> I got a blade, your breath. I would highly recommend hitting before he has enough pips free free. We got a little bit of time. Oh, you put another prism on? I didn't even see you put that on. Just I did last turn. I must be blind. All right. Okay, I have one more blade, and then I'm just gonna hit whatever. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I only have one more prism after this, so yeah. We gotta make this one count, huh? I have to say this is actually probably the hardest bosses we've had just because he could eat free. Uh yep, yeah, you're good to hit. I mean there's certain spells that each school can use that like is You know, more. he had his he had his time to shine. Like it just destroys it's, it's time for this cat to retire. Like the one time the the guy siren. I would prefer to get Siren over e freed it. Actually, no. Well, the worst is e freed when you hit. That's the worst. Actually, e is worse because yeah. then I have no way, like, with our setup, I have no way of removing that. So. Basically, we have an extra blade because he used the bubble. So. Play! <laughs> How hard would you cross in your toes for that crit? I mean, he could block. We've seen it before. Nah. Nah. Yeah. That's what he deserves. <laughs> That's what he deserves. Oh my gosh. I feel That's bad for his death. Might, you might even reach the pen dragon before he devours you. <laughs> I'm surprised I did that much. Mm. This is a better deck. I think I got a... Yeah. Well, grats, Nate. <laughs> Be careful of popping out there. You might get pulled. Use a potion. I just realized I'm going the complete opposite way. You know the quest helper in this one can fool you. It's a April, deceiver. April Fool 2.0, yeah. 3.0, excuse me. 3.0 at this point. You did it! <laughs> Thanks, Squire! Head into the Royal Garden. Creeps of hey! To distract the trend kill Creeps of Wrath, I had to read that book. The gardens. When you can, I know. grab a pomegranate. And when you can! Did you ever to read that? Uh, Grapes of... I think I did. I don't Grapes remember. Of All of those English books just converge into one story. <laughs> they, like, drive in their, like, car or something. Yeah, I think... They're buggy. I don't know. I, I think they <laughs> Where die. am I going right now? Where are we? Nate? Oh, my gosh. And they have to, like, work in, like, the, the fields for, like, two cents an hour. Something like that. Yeah, I think oh, I, I think I think I read that book. Oh, we only have to kill one. All right, it's not bad. Actually, I don't even know if they work for. Let's be honest, Nate. A lot basically, of those, yeah. basically, it's rough times. Oh, it's all it's all sad. They have a lot of health. So I'll double blade you. Why did I just get you down here? Yeah. Need to put in a cleanse after this battle. I cannot forget. So these guys also drop a new pet. 
I didn't know that, Nate. Have you gotten it yet? Yeah, the shook on. Didn't the know. Trend, trend kill Pantera looks the same as them. That's actually kind of cool, then, huh? There were other Pantera pets before them, right? There is, yeah, like the Storm one. I don't know if, it, if there's other ones besides the Storm one. It's got to have kind of a uh, an emerald look to them. But uh, what's interesting is these guys are Storm. Yeah. Just like, just like the other Pantera, like they're basically the same. They just look different and they have a different name. But the pet is uh, like a life and death, I think. I think it's a life and death like hybrid. Well, kind of. Yeah. That's an interesting breed. So it's kind of weird that these guys are storm. That is odd. Alright, well, have me here. <laughs> what? I don't think Meteor can do 3.2. I mean, okay. I believe in I you. I did a lot more damage than I did uh, in the previous thing, so I don't know. Oh, no, the, the bubble. The bubble makes a big difference. That's probably why. You're right. That extra like 35 or 20. Might have to start popping a few uh, bubble goods in your deck. Mm. I mean, it's the same as a blade though, so. Right. I mean, theoretically, could I wear a fire mastery? Yeah. But then again, we're getting these higher worlds and you're going to be crit on be like with one leg and you'll be dead, Rev. Yeah, when I start actually getting crit on? Right. And right. then, if then you like wish I had the, that life mastery. Uh-huh. And they actually start using spells that are crazy. But then Polaris, it's chill. Alright, we got him. No pet. I am putting in that cleanse before I take one more step. Wherever it is. Do, do I even have cleanses on my guy? Yeah, I do. Right. I don't know. The one pomegranate. What a glorious port pack. Right. The blessed pomegranate of Avalon will use it to blow up the armory and send the... First shalt thou raise the blessed pomegranate, then shalt thou count to three. No more, no less. Three shall be the number thou shalt count, and the number of the counting shalt be three. Once the number three be reached, Lobbis... I get it, three, sister. Towards thou Lobbis, is that a word? Armory. It he is. L-O-B-S-T? Yeah. Thou Lobbist the... Pomegranate. You wind up to throw, and on the count of three, you hurl the Did pomegranate it. through the window. Quite <laughs> the explosion from a piece of fruit. Look, the guards have fled. Once again, extremely confused how a piece of fruit explodes. It's magical. Did you see the look on their faces? <laughs> what a miracle. Now you can enter the Overlook Tower. Inside is a lever to open the portcullis that leads to Lake Nebula. Thank the gods. However, you'll probably have to thrash the spiny I mean, spriggan who hangs out back. inside. Ooh, a little close there, dear. Huh? Guy. We get a little close to the fence. Yeah, we. I mean, it's the last tower before we go to Lake Shore, Nate. So we made it, man. We finished out our yard. Oh yeah, because entrance is right there. It is. Spriggan, we've seen them before. An odd beast. Probably gonna be storm. Did you make that big boot Ooh, I outside? What a ruckus! It made my ears ring. So I think I'll rip yours off. I've Fair. noticed Avalon. They throw a lot more roasting around than other world. They try to roast. Battling Jackie. <laughs> well, I you're think dead. They're all fierce and stuff. Uh, I mean, Nate, let's be honest. If you saw one of these cats 1v1 on the street IRL, would you run? Yes, you would. They're probably really tall. If they are twice the size of us, like 12 foot, theoretically. Yeah, they look like they're 12 foot. Because we're like about, I don't know, 5 or 6 right now in game. Six. Yeah. 
Well, I mean, you know, I would, I would run. Crit raw. There's no reason for this spell to even happen right now. Wow. Oh. What? Damn. You know, I can't be mad at that. I mean, yeah, we're doing a fair amount. Yeah, it's alright. Mm, okay. There's that one cleanse I have in for good measure. I'm never removing that. I did move it pre remove it previously, which, well, as we saw. Well, it's a really low chance that you actually. It is, Nate. Okay, I'm gonna hit as soon as I have dragon because he's ice. Oh my. Are you nervous? Are you nervous getting crit on? I'm sweating a little bit. No, he's ice night boost and the overtime will do a lot. No joke, it's really hot in my weakness? room right now. Okay, good. Heat up. <laughs> it is, dude. The circulation in my room is horrendous. Cookie, please. I am kind of low. When I start getting below 3,000, but when I get below 2,000. I was below 2,000. Right. No, this should get her. First hit won't slap unless I crit. I think you've delved enough time inside of volcanoes recently. Okay, I mean, crits are on point. This episode, so. They are. Oh, okay. But can she block the overtime? I don't think she's that good. Boom. Isn't that good? She's not good. Mm. Still alive, though. Last round. Surprise, her toes ain't melted. Oh, Duh, she likes, okay, thank you. She likes to crit. Thank you for letting me block their, uh... Get them. New crit block system? Yeah, she Oh, does. my gosh. Bye-bye. Oh, me ringing head. Okay. Oh, I got some steel from that boss. It's actually not bad. I get you hear a low grinding Oh my gosh. Like a gate being raised. Peace yeah. it faster than I you can think, I clicked it at the mate. exact time as you did, so it looked like I clicked it, but it didn't actually you know, count. Quicker than you. Yeah. Did you leave a market, sister? Oh, I'm speaking. Oh my gosh. Look at you. Well done. You are a brave and virtuous knight, to be sure. With your help, I've no doubt we'll overthrow the Pendragon. Go through the portcullis and down the steps to reach Lake Shore. I've heard the Pendragon's evil servants are out in force, sure. but I'm sure you'll find good folk loyal to the Lady of the Lake. See you, sister. Never see you again. Um. Goodbye, Warwick, the prophet. A stable profit. Yeah. Just this little door leads to like a huge area that is Lake Shore. Surprised. Hello! We're here. If you climb down the steep steps to reach Lake Shore, you can feel an evil presence squatting over the sacred waters. Over yonder, you see someone dressed in simple hermit's robes. Really nice uh, looking area, though. This is one of my favorite places ever because it just makes kind. Oh. It just it makes enough sense to make sense. That's a really difficult thing to go down. <laughs> yeah, be careful, Nate. These things pull. We have to defeat them too soon. I'm stuck on everything. Yes, this is the end for me. You okay? A little wagon to get stuck on. I saw you with your spell <laughs> Where'd you go? Oh. And I was sure you were one of the Pendragon's wild hunt. It eases my heart to know that my last moments will be in the presence of a kind knight, loyal to Queen Gwendolyn. Rest in peace, Friar Akka! I was gravely wounded by the stag chargers. If you could get some water from the Pool of Radiance, it might restore me. So we have to get some healing waters. I mean, they called it the sacred waters when we got here. 
This is not a good sign. The pool that is the most gone. depressing thing I've ever seen in my life. What are we going to tell him now? He's just going to die. Mm. The pool of radiance is run dry. Look it's at really those sandals, really Nate. Can I have those? The simplest answer is that it must have been the vile work of the Pendragon's pet bug witch, Black Annie. You tell him. How could she have done it? The simplest answer is she must have stolen the gems from the magical elfin statues. Did she do it herself? Doubtful. She most likely had the stag chargers do it. Defeat the stag chargers to get back the gems and restore the elfin statues. If the pool of radiance vanishes, oh, I might still be brought back from death's door. Hmm. Well, I guess it's gem hunting. Got him. You know, too bad. Wait, where's? Oh, up there. It's up here. Oh yeah. The, oh yeah. Here they are. There's actually kind of cool statues. Yeah. Oh, there it is. It light up. Yeah, I got like a a green aura. I'm trying to remember though too, but like from my myth walk, this part of Avalon, like restoring this waterfall, is a really big moment for me. When it's restored. The oh yeah. It's kind of cool. Light up with a magical yeah, there it is. Glow. There is a soft rumble of thunder and the sound of waves crashing on a distant shore. Suddenly, the waters begin to rush again. The waterfall splashes merrily, and a cool mist rises. The pool That's a really cool moment. Why was it like a finished. big moment? <laughs> I don't know, just the fact that like I've never seen something just completely animate from... Yeah, that's, it, is, it is a cool animation. That, that's, I guess that's probably why. I've always remembered that for some reason. What do you know? It was only mostly dead. I'm gonna have to revise that theorem. Now why are you here? To find the lady, of course. Nothing could be simpler. The lady of the lake has been trapped above the waters of Nimue, in the holes of the Doris Tower. There is a magical path that leads over the water to the Doris Tower, but the secret is guarded by the Abbot of Whitehaven. Black Annie Strangler goblins are trying to smoke the abbot out of the abbey. <laughs> Chase him off! Oh my gosh. What kind of cave is this? In the cave? Whoa. Oh, it's the teleporter thing. What a sinister yeah. plan to smoke yeah. the abbot out. As you <laughs> Can I do this? The door opens and the abbot yeah. emerges. Funniest thing is, is like what he actually says. Like we're trying to smoke out the abbot. Uh, smoked him. You might need some help with this. Uh. One. Thank you for your help. Are you somebody loyal to Avalon and the Good Queen? It's Gwen good to know uh, Big G uh, speaks gibberish. <laughs> speaks <laughs> abbot. <laughs> Seems like she smoked a few pipes in her day. She's <laughs> a pipe as a light. Yeah, what, what else does she have to do up in that house? <laughs> the Shalskirkers is another defeat of oh. the Shalskirkers. Then destroy the kegs of effluent. Talk to the abbot when you You know, I didn't understand a word he said, so I technically don't have to defeat these four foul skirkers. Two battles. I, I technically don't have to defeat it because I don't understand a word he said. My highest compliments, you're a better servant than the noble king Artorius. My highest compliments. You are yeah, truly we got it. a Let's servant of noble king Artorius. <laughs> like... Additionally, you think you are finally beginning to understand. Although the lady of the lake has been reduced, she's not without her allies. The Seraph Guardian make of the Lost Tower will attack anyone. Oh yeah, me too. Unless you show that you are a friend. Get a branch from the old tree and signal the Seraph from the shoreline. Tell me when you've done this. Leaving a big juicy mark here so I don't have to mm -hmm. travel back. Easy. Oh my. Okay, easy, so easy. Easy, easy, <laughs> Because you just keep running. Yeah, you chill. Uh, I'm stuck. Stop. Okay, I'm stuck. All right, we're good. I've already gotten stuck like five times in Lakeshore. <laughs> Yeah, you got it. I don't know if it's like one. rain or what. I don't know. Oh, did I collect it? Is it right here? Did you collect it? No, I did. Go to the shoreline. Okay. I did not collect it for some reason. Proud. Even though I was there before you and I collected mm -hmm. it. I know it. <clears throat> I know the feeling. You step up to the shore and wave the olive branch slowly toward the Dolorous Tower. The shoreline. Seraph sees you uh... and raises her sword in salute. I'll be back at the uh, Abbot. Get him. Oh, it's the opposite. You've made a friend. 
There's a signal horn hanging from a tree, now covered in chalk by goblin kudzu vines. You'll have to rip the vines away. Once you see the signal horn, send it to show okay, you the path you. over Lake Nimue. You'll have to deal with Black Annie. Now she holds the iron key to the Dolores Tower. With it, you can enter and find the lady. I think we're killing Black Annie uh, next day here, so... I'll be by the vine that you have to cut. Make my way. You rip away the goblin kudzu vines. Yeah, he's talking about Black Annie. And sticky with a dark sap that stings. You clear enough to get to the tree. There is the signal okay, horn. Okay, cut the vine. There it is. Reach the signal horn and raise it to your lips. The sound is low and long. It announces you are here and also calls a challenge to Black Annie. The sound. Yep, Black Annie. It's time, short. Rev. Long after you lower the horn, a path reveals itself. To the, the witch house. The, <clears throat> the hut. Yeah. Cannot forget this crow uh, in here. I think we'll be able to finish uh, Lakeshore today, too. So that's good. All right, time to get the crow. Make sure crow's in here. Nothing abnormal about a uh, hut on tentacles. A visitor. So pretty. There's the crow. Your presence warms my sanguine heart. Can I get it? Now I'll roast your heart on a spit. Got him. Nice, got it too. All right. Here okay. we go. A really spooky hut. You know, like, giganormous. Yeah, it's a big hut. But it's kind of the theme. It, it is. Oh my gosh, more of those hairy, blueberry, shackled, earthquake-using, get em goods. Yeah, they're... Not my favorite, uh... Plus, I mean, they just have a lot of health. Like, they have like 3,000. Oh, yeah, I think Black Annie cheats. Eh. Ah, vampire. What did she do? I used a faint. She's using vampire. It's a fair trade. I don't mind that. It helps her sleep at night. Good for her. I think she needs a shower. To be oh! It's a little worse than, uh... Well, you can still oh, double faint. You see, yeah, there it is. Well, yeah, I need to faint. My goodness me. Vampire in the... Wait, does she do something? No, Probably. Probably. Nope. Is that her actual attack? Or is that a cheat? Okay, I good. think, yeah. I think we can blade. Well, you do have this cheeky guy over here getting earthquake ready. <laughs> oh, he's already ready. <laughs> I mean, I have to blade. I can't not blade. You're right. You you have to. <laughs> like I already have a blade up, so. Yeah, there's no going back. I'm stunned, so I just yeah, uh, just. Wait, what? I don't know. What's going on? My some kind of some kind of voodoo, voodoo breath. Oh, this could be bad. Okay, okay, it's not as bad as it could be. Yeah, it's gonna be thousand. No, I'm talking like Leviathan. Oh, uh, yeah. That would be worse. That would be worse. Don't even. Don't. <laughs> he was thinking about it. His little blueberry mind. The fact that he still might use it, Nate, so I wouldn't rest easy. Well, you can paint, I can hit. I gotta be honest, there are noxious fumes in this hut. I honestly believe it's either that brew she's brewing back there, or it's actually her <laughs> greasy hair. Alright, you can paint again, and then I can drag. Yeah, we need to get a good hit on her. We need to get a good crit. <laughs> well, like, at least... Uh, I'm scared. This is Dragonstone, but you have a stun block. It's good that you got a hit, though. That's fine. I think Falmia's roots can uh, fly over the lake and um, reach us inside of this smelly okay. hut. Critical can <laughs> yeah, reach us in this hut all the way. Right. I knew it. She was cute with her brew in the back. Nice, didn't block it. Really good, Nate. Could have went way worse. Okay. 
How much? Oh, uh, that does not kill unless you. Get, uh, <laughs> you're gonna get stunned in vampire. It's all right. <laughs> it's worth. It is worth. Oh, this cat dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We heard it before. You smell. There's like moss growing down the sides of the walls. You know, I gotta be honest. I'm surprised she doesn't have some type of like disease. And the fact, like, if mold grows, I'm pretty sure you get sick. Like you inhale that mold vapors. Yeah. She doesn't look good. No, I mean she's a witch, Nate. Like she literally lives inside of goo. Jade. Um. Uh, she became goo again. That's actually really disgusting. I um, I just got. Did you see that? <laughs> May you face a thousand deaths. Take this blasted iron key and be done with. That was me. actually the most disgusting. Like, death animation I think I've ever seen. I need a moment. <laughs> like, what was that? I don't know. I got a raven pet, though. A raven pet? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, just take that in for a little bit. Let that brew. You approach the that's terrorist. that's probably what she was brewing. <laughs> you are what you eat. Like, <laughs> I don't know what that was, then. Yeah. Enter the tower. All right, we get it. We're entering. Thank you. What's in here? Kind of mystical. Oh, there she is. Good to see oh, yeah, she opens up the catacombs, I think. A glorious wizard and a knight of the weird, both in one. Truly, this is a portentous day. Of course I was expecting you, clever child. None other than an apprentice of Merle Ambrose could have freed me, or found Queen Gwendolyn, or defeated the Bane Worm. Come, gaze upon the stell of Nicole, and see what name is prophesied to restore Avalon. Literally talking to a rock. So we're prophesized. You feel an immense power and weight pushing down upon you. There is a hum of energy, and a swirl of mana, and a flash upon the stone. Oh. Well, alrighty. Glorious, That's actually pretty cool. <laughs> you have come to ask me about the Sword of Kings. I have returned it to its place of rest in Castle Avalon. Do not fear. The Pendragon cannot draw it, for he is tainted. The sword waits until you are ready to face the wild hunt. Come, meet me outside this Tower of Sorrow. What well, says my name? You were prophesized. I was. Oh, here she is. There are two more nightly shrines you must visit before you will be deemed worthy of drawing the Sword of Kings. One is here, the other harder to reach. But first things first. We need to restore the shrine to mercy of a gentle rain from above upon the place beneath on both givers and takers. The stag charges on the shore <laughs> stole Mercy's shield, while the stag oh. goblins have Mercy's sword. <laughs> will you get them back? Wow. That's a fun one. Like, we, we save her just so she can give us a collectum good. You know, what an app. Yeah, I mean, we basically, like, almost finished Lakeshore. Like, Black Annie's a big part of that, so. Dude, we're going to the catacombs next step, regard. We're go oh, I didn't even look at the, the map. What do we got going on here? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's pretty cool. Black Annie's not even on the map, really. Or, like, a doodle. Right, no. Be she's doodle not. Black Annie, but, but She's yeah. actually a big part of this area. I mean, yeah, her hut is, uh, it's pretty big. On the inside, at least. <laughs> but yeah, that is going to be it. Finished uh, Outer Yard, and then we did a lot of Lakeshore. So we'll be finishing up next time doing the catacombs with uh, the Lady of the Lake. So if you guys enjoyed it, stuck all the, way, all the way through this video. Make sure to leave a like on it, subscribe for more in the future, and we'll see you all next time.